San Diego came away with that victory 35-32. Matt Trueville, the captain of the Houston Sabercats, told me he really thinks that it was that loss here in San Diego that turned their season upside down. They finished one and seven on the year, and he said it does trace back to this game. They executed well up front, but they just did not seal the deal. They're looking for a different outcome here today. NBA Summer League right here on NBA TV 2220 and welcome back everybody. I'm Stacy Pates joined with DeMarcus Cousins. Now listen, when you are sitting courtside watching these young fellas, what are you most excited about? Ladies and gentlemen, we knew it would be a battle. Number one versus number two right now to present. They say it every day here in San Diego. We are Legion. Listen, if you're going to go, go big. 22-10 right now. I am with the Invicta, the cohort. Listen, I don't know if this matches my shoes, but I'm glad they let me wear it. I wanted to wear this one, but that was a little complicated. This guy has a sword. I have a microphone. This game is massive. Mark, take it away. <laughs> Looking good, Stace. Hi everybody, I'm Stacey Pates and welcome to NCAA On Campus. Our story today takes us to the University of Delaware, where the women's basketball team has been ranked in the nation's top 20 for the first time in school history.